Okay, babe, so I forgot that I still need to put together this bookcase. It's gonna go here on this wall because dragging that thing up the stairs in this box was a nightmare. <laughs> It was a nightmare. Um, I don't know what possessed me to think that I could do this by myself, but we don't give it a shot. So I got my pajamas on, kind of, sort of, and I'm already getting hot. <laughs> Just dragging that thing upstairs, I was getting hot. So um, I still have on my sweatpants too, but I'm going to take this off and I'm going to attempt to try to film this again we don't know how this is gonna go i don't know we gonna see we gonna see babes here we go going in okay first of all i'm nervous because it came with a whole rack of instructions and like all of the parts this like 20, 20 parts to this thing. <laughs> 20 parts to this thing. Um, sorry, 21. 21 parts. Look at this. 21 parts. Ugh. Okay. Um, and suction cups, assembly bolts, hex key, which is good, so I don't need to get any screwdrivers or anything because that would have caused me much angst because I don't know where all that stuff is. Um, holy free holies. I don't know what to do first. I'm so, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I should have hired someone to do this. Oh my lord. Oh my stars. I don't know. So I think I'm supposed to build the base first and then I put the glass on top. When it's all said and done, it's supposed to look like this. I don't know if you see it. It's supposed to look like this what it's gonna actually look like, we don't know yet. <laughs> We're not quite sure. Oh my, oh my God. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> I have all eight of the metal legs. Okay. Oh my God. Okay, eight metal legs. I'm gonna put them over here on the side. Oh my God, what was I thinking? All right, we're gonna do this. Girl power and all, we're gonna do this. These are some screws I have. Let's be. Let's be. In there. Okay. And close that back up. They held it with a little piece of tape. So these are A's and D's. And these are C's and B's. Hopefully the C's and the B's are where they're supposed to be because those are the ones that fell. Okay. Because I see this is 15, this is 15, this is 15. So this is all for 15. So let's put all of those together. Where are my ASMR folks? Y'all should be having a field day right now because we popping things and we are playing with saran wrap plastic. This is Ooh. Need those instructions. Can't lose that. This is what number 
number is this? Well, what number are you, special piece? This is gonna be a nightmare. I'll be back. I think I got it, I think. Here it is, okay. So one and one, make two. <laughs> Bottom of these are these little gray things, I think. No? They don't fit. I ain't even going front. I ain't do all this. <laughs> I'm putting on the suction cups now, but I had to call Audible, y'all. This was an undertaking. It took me over an hour to realize that I had the legs on this thing wrong. And that's where it all went downhill. <laughs> It is midnight. I just couldn't finish it in time to put it up in the vlog. So, as you can see, hair is like all over the place. I'm hot. I'm tired. It's midnight. It's been a lot. It's been a long day. But, um, it is complete. Um, I will show you the finished product tomorrow because I'm not going to put the glass in today. I'm just going to put these suctions in and then I am going to scrub my face and call it a night. Sorry, the heater is on too. I got hot and I got cold. <laughs> Listen, I'm a little paunchy right now because I was like, I cannot possibly deal with this and upload my video and try to put this thing together. I need to take the numbers off. That's how tired. <laughs> I need to take the numbers off. We'll do that tomorrow. It's been a long day, babes. Um, you know, I'm gonna put my Chanel stuff up here and some Dior stuff and, you know, this will just be my little display case for makeup and, you know, maybe some things. Maybe I'll put some bags up here figuring that all out but I wanted to get the stuff the clutter off of the floor and this was the only way to do it to get a bookshelf so that's what I did <laughs> that's what I did all right babes I'm gonna go and finish putting these suction pieces on and then get ready for bed but wanted you to see the finish piece, piece de resistance. Uh, beauty room is coming together slowly but surely. It's all coming together and uh, it should be nice at the end of the day. It should be really nice in here. It's nice in here now, but I think with these little accoutrements, it'll be even better. So with that, I'll see ya tomorrow morning. Hi babes, welcome back to my channel. I did receive my package from Amazon that I was talking about in my vlog today, my live vlog today that I did for Bellamis. So I'm still waiting for one other piece to arrive, but here is the bag. Okay, so here it is. Like I said, it is Chanel-esque, not Chanel. <laughs> but here's how we're going to make it Chanel. It's pretty, nice little flap there. And then, oops. Open that up. Um, oh, that's 
that's nice. I like the chain, it's very weighty, good quality. So here's what it looks like empty. Let's put my Chanel makeup bag inside here to make it Chanel. And then close it up. And so now it's a Chanel bag. I'll just slide the chain. Move like this, and then bam, it is a crossbody. And so, what I wanted to get to include here was they have like this pearl handle that I wanted to get to just clip on because it has lobster claws. So, I'm going to clip it onto here so that I can carry it like this. I could probably just do that with the chain too, but adding the pearl I thought would be a nice touch. Plus it's also in gold. So there we go. Now this is kind of like my take on the By the Sea, which is a Chanel PVC bag, which is what this is. That one does come with like CCs because it's a real Chanel bag, but it has real sand in it. And then you can just place whatever you want inside on top of the sand and it becomes a by the sea bag and that has the pearl. So this will be my take on it when I put the pearl handle on it. This will be my take of that bag because I just did not see paying as much money as it cost for a plastic bag from Chanel when I can pay a fraction of that and get this bag that I can use as a bag on the shoulder or as a crossbody. Bam. Or as a just clutch that you can hold. So this is how you make a Chanel bag by Bella. <laughs> All right, day number six. And we have something from Huda Beauty. It is a lip tint in cherry and it's called coral cutie so let's swatch it and see what it looks like uh-oh pound fail <laughs> it came completely out of the vessel <laughs> man this day <laughs> Batting a thousand today, batting a thousand. Whatever this is, I'm drinking it. <laughs> it's been one hell of a day, babes. Let's open day six of the advent calendar. And it is, uh-oh. It is a Pinot Gris from Medicino County by Mr. B again. So this is the second one from Mr. B. Why can't this thing focus today? All right, we're scratching it off. So at least I can tell you the tasting notes before I drink this thing. I don't even care if it's not chilled. So this is a Pinot Gris from California. Tasting notes are nectarine, apple, and lemon. Hopefully you can see that. All right, babes. Until tomorrow, you've been bellified. <laughs>